got them. Ooh. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video where today I've woken up in Leo Gang where the World Cup was actually hosted this weekend just gone. But as that circuit is leaving town, we're rocked up and I'm ready to shred the epic bike park. Let's just take one moment to appreciate that insane view behind me, which is actually Bike Park Leo Gang. You've got the finishing corral for the World Cup down there. You've got the dirt jump slope line, which is the old 26 tricks course. And you've got a sick pump track, which hopefully throughout the next few days, we're going to be getting some tires on all of those features. But for now, I'm going to sit down here and pad up and then take the very short cycle over to the lift station. How sick is that? We're staying so close to the lifts. We're actually basically staying in the bike park, but we've now made our way to the very top of the mountain, which is quite a long way. And I've come straight over to GoPro Hot Shots, which is an expert only jump line. I can't remember how many jumps there are in a row on this trail, but it's actually insane. There's so many. It's three kilometers though, three, 3.3 kilometers of jumps. And I've decided today, to switch things up because the whole trip so far I've used the e-bike and I've decided today to go on the ghost enduro bike which is working sick I've already done a few runs because I wanted to remember the line before filming this clip but it starts with quite a sizable drop there we go look at that you've got three options like a hip one a small one middle and then a rolling which is actually death I don't think I'd want to go down that but I'm going to switch this up two angles we've got the chesty and you guys on their heads so I think we should just enjoy these amazing conditions and drop straight in to Hot Shots. Hey, look what these boys are. Right, here we go then, GoPro Hot Shots. Let's get it, I'm stoked for this. So many jumps in a row. Oh, quite an aggressive drop there to start with. Phew. I think some of these jumps are quite large on this. If I remember right, so from last year. But we'll see. Nice, little steezer. To that right oh and they land on the next takeoff okay we've got a big one so much air time on that and this one wow okay they're massive jumps uh oh catching up some riders who are going slower hopefully they're not going to get in my way we'll find out up there. thank you Good thank you Sean there we go alright we're through it's quite funny I let them go ages ahead of me because they were waiting at the top I waited probably 10 minutes. I only made about three jumps down. Woo! The air time is insane. We haven't really done much jumping on this trip. So it's actually feeling quite good to hit a couple of jumps and throw some whips. Woo. The lips are quite steep though. I think you'd have to ride them a lot to really be confident and super loose, but you know, we're getting by. Third run down and I'm hitting everything, giving it a bit of style or trying to. So fast. Little table there. <laughs> go that is the halfway point that trail is actually insane so 
some of the jumps are massive some of the lips feel a bit poppy and a bit funny but you know it's one of the things the more you rode it the more you get used to knowing where to break and i think that's the challenge is there's a lot of areas where the speed's way too much and you're hitting quite big jumps that you could get really wrong but i'm happy with that that was a nice little section at the top good news is it carries on up and in i've literally just got down and these guys are like cars should i follow so obviously yeah straight in with a follow down Shots in the air gang. There we have it, GoPro hot shots. Incredible trail. Jumps are big, full speed, and then you get down and you've got this insane view behind you. It doesn't really get much better than that. What a day. We're straight from the mountain back down to the bike garage, which I mean they're not steady racks, but we're switching the enduro bike to the dirt jump bike. So we're gonna go have a little play on the pump track, but I just wanted to show you how sick this hotel is because not only is it the most secure bike garage ever but there's a stand and there's a bench and tool chest full of everything that you would need that's actually incredible hopefully we won't need to come down here and repair any bikes but i'm excited the lifts are finished and we're gonna go and ride the pump track just look at how insane this pump track is it's actually incredible, I can't believe it. I'm just hitting the outside line, which is actually like the most jumpy one. But it's so fast, the corners are so steep. It's insane. And you can walk there from the, the hotel. It's down there, that's our room there. It's, it's, a, it's a paradise, it's a heaven. I could just stay here forever, I think. It actually starts off really slow. You have to like manual to gain speed. And then uh, this one, is when you can start jumping and you got this sideways takeoff which is quite insane you nice oh yeah sick insane pump tracking right we're gonna hit another line now the inside line so let's see what it's about. The berms are insane, trust me. Wait till you see the tight ones in a minute. The speed that you can carry. This one, ready? Oh my God. Ooh. Phew. KJ, you've got to go over there and get a shot of that berm. Okay. Oh my god, that's so crazy how quick he goes around that. Those turns are incredible. I don't think I've ever gone around a corner so fast. Cara's now very unhappy because 
I found a manual line which involves her running and it's so warm. It's about 37 degrees today. Well, it's not quite that hot, but she's got to run along the top whilst I manny the straight. We've left the pump track for a moment and we've now made it up to ride the slope line which is the old 26 tricks course which is actually a contest that I never got to come ride although I always dreamed of doing it but it doesn't happen now so the closest I'm ever going to get to riding it is today and it's sick the bottom half they've been working on it today so it's a bit soft I'm gonna leave that and come back and ride it properly in another video like a full session because there's an airbag down there which is also deflated but for now these first two big ones I'm just going to do a couple of tricks just to cap this day off and it's absolutely roasting. Here we go then, dropping in for 26 tricks slope style. Nice big old backflip. Tail whip, you! What a line. Like I said a minute ago, the, the track actually carries on around, but that hip down there. They were reshaping the landing, so I don't want to be that guy to go and ride it. I want to give it overnight, let it sink in, let it settle, and then we'll hit some laps. But for now, I think we should get a nice slow motion 360 one foot can on this with those mountains in the background. Right, we're now up at the pool, straight from pump track and dirt jumps. And this thing's insane look it's this massive infinity pool up here on the roof probably the best way to cool down after riding so i'm gonna jump in look at the view this way it's so nice mountains and then there's a swimming pool but what's actually really weird is that there's snow on the mountains over there but it's boiling in here it's so weird there we have it just like that our day in leo gang is Complete. It was so nice to refresh in the swimming pool after a hot day shredding GoPro hot shots, pump track, and slope style. And best of all, it's only our first day of three here, so the action is only going to get better from here. We've actually just had a four course meal and we're both sat out on the balcony now. Car, actually, you can't even move, can you? No, I have to lay down. I'm too full. <laughs> <laughs> Which was sick. And, you know, that view, it doesn't get old. We're sat here editing our videos in the bike park which is so crazy but that's a wrap for this one i hope that you guys have enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up leave your comments down below and we will both see you guys in the next video i'm like an addict do i gotta have it i ain't even playing got a really bad habit if it moves gotta grab it fuels like a magnet lose won't have it till i'm doomed in a casket I ain't playing, got a weird mind. If you work eight hours, I'ma work nine. If the shoot tastes sour, you should taste mine. I'ma stay in power for a long time. Get up, nah, I ain't a